Hey there, welcome to my channel. My name is Leah and tonight I am doing my husband's favorite makeup look. Tonight I am going to be getting ready for date night with my husband, which means I'm going to do his favorite makeup look on me. So tonight I'm trying the e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer. Poreless Putty Primer, that's what I say. Again, because I saw somebody applying it with one of these foundation brushes that nobody uses for foundation, but they keep making and trying to sell us on. I have never had a good experience with this in foundation, but I saw somebody using it for this primer, so we're gonna give it a whirl. While I'm letting that kind of set down and do its thing, I'm gonna do my brows. I'm gonna do my makeup in kind of a weird order for me tonight, but I'm just trying something new. Um, I'm gonna do my brows before my eyeshadow. I just like to, I don't know why. I think it's because I can see the frame of like where my makeup's gonna be as far as how my brows are gonna look. Um, so I always do my brows before my eyeshadow. All right, well, while I'm getting these guys on, Mike and I, Mike is my husband. We've been married for some time like five years five years five years this year um and we have recently had some changes in our life with our schedule we both started new jobs in the last few months so that means um we're not spending as much time together um i work 8 to 4 30 so 8 a.m to 4 like basically an 8 to 5 job and mike's job is 10 a.m no 11 a.m to 7 30 so he gets off in about a half hour. And our schedules have now become wake up in the morning, Mike gets Magnus ready, I work at home, so I just like throw on some sweats or whatever, help get kiddo dressed and out the door, Mike takes him to daycare, and then I work, Mike comes home, he gets himself ready, he goes to work, I'm off at 4.30, I go pick up our kid at daycare, come home, feed him, wash him, play with him, um, etc and then he gets ready for bed and then Mike comes home right at bedtime <sighs> so then he goes Magnus goes to bed Mike and I spend you know maybe an hour together in the evenings that looks crazy town with one brow and nothing else on maybe this is a look hmm. so anyway basically and then our evening becomes Mike is eating dinner while I'm putting Magnus to bed and then by the time we're all you know back together we spend maybe an hour together trying to like watch one of our shows from the week and then I go to bed and he falls asleep on the couch because that's how it goes so basically we haven't had much time together lately my parents came home from Arizona this week um, they're little snowbirds so they've been at their home down south because you know fall cold they want to be in the desert understandably so they come home right about this time every year for the holidays so they'll be here through the new year um but so the good thing about that is magnus gets to sleep over at their house and mike and i are actually having a date night that is not going grocery shopping it's very exciting <laughs> we're gonna go eat dinner and I have decided that I want a bacon cheeseburger really bad from this one restaurant that we like. So we're going to go there. I have to say that this $3 brow pencil from LA Girl, LA, LA Girl that I got at CVS, this is like the best brow pencil ever. I've tried some more high-end ones and I've tried like CoverGirl and whatever, but this one is my absolute favorite as far as like how it looks and the pigment and I mean this one is probably a little bit dark for me but god this is a good brow pencil and it's so cheap <sighs> I like it I'm just gonna put a little bit of concealer on on my lids I'm not gonna do anything too crazy tonight um well I might as well just tell you what I'm doing so Mike's favorite makeup look on me and I don't know if it's his favorite makeup look in general is um like a pretty light eye with like maybe like a little bit of a smoky eye and then really really red lips i mean we're children of the 80s so i think like that robert palmer video palmer robert palmer video really influenced what he likes as far as a makeup look so i'm just gonna do that for my eyes i'm gonna use this palette from tarte it's the clay play palette it's like shadows and some bronzer contoury colors that I got in my boxy charm last month um I don't know about this but it's like nice neutrals and it's browns like this is clearly not going to work as a bronzer for me I mean or a contour it's just way too dark um so we're going to use some of these shades I think what I'm going to do is just use 
these three here and then maybe a little bit of this black or this dark brown just in the corners. Um, no, ooh, that's got some good pigment. I'm surprised. Usually I don't love Tarte palettes, but I use this shade here called Stone. It's got some pretty good pigment right away. Um, so you may notice that my hair is straight. If you've watched my channel for a while, you know I do videos on curly wavy hair and my hair is straight tonight um, because I wanted to see first of all like how my grays are coming in and I am so pleased with this stripe that I have in the front. I am stoked on it and I've got another like little baby one back here but this one is making me so happy happy um but i want so i wanted to see like how my grays have come in plus i just wanted to kind of check the length like it's really long and i've cut it a few times but i cannot tell you how healthy my hair is right now so um i've been doing the curly girl method on my hair for just a little over a year and my hair is so freaking healthy it took me about two seconds two seconds but like it took me less than five minutes to straighten my hair and I use the um, Amika straightening brush it is a godsend and it could be just like my hair type I have very fine but like a lot of hair so straightening with a flat iron took forever um, and my waves have always been really stubborn so using that Amika brush changed everything that was a Christmas gift from like two years ago and I love it to this day. All right, so I'm just going to buff out the edges with this solstice, sol, solstice color right here. I am so pleasantly surprised with this palette so far. I have had other Tarte palettes and not liked them very much at all. So I was expecting not to, to be, you know, I was expecting to be pretty underwhelmed by this one, but these mattes are actually very nice. So thank you, BoxyCharm, for sending me this probably old or not great selling palette from Tarte because I'm kind of liking it. I'm gonna also take this solstice shade and do something I wouldn't normally do and just put it a little bit on my lids just to kind of brighten up this inner area here. Yeah, that looks all right. I'm gonna do a liner so it'll kind of bring it all back. For liner, I'm going to do a pretty simple wing with this Smashbox Always On Liquid Eyeliner. Um, I am going to just do it in fast forward because I cannot speak and put this on at the same time. So here we go. Right, so I had to pull my hair back because it was trying to get all up and everything. So foundation does. All right, so I'm gonna use the Tarte Foundsealer Multitasking Blah 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 Babasu Foundation. This is 24G Light Golden. I do think it's a little too yellow for me, um, so I'm trying to use this one up. I like how it feels, but it doesn't have a lot of stay on my skin. So that's what I'm kind of hoping with this poreless putty, it might work a little better. I don't know. I'm trying to get through this bottle. That's all there's to it, really. All right, so Mike is on his way home, which means I get to eat soon, so I'm very excited about that. I don't know why, I'm just hungry today. I think I, oh, my ear is really pink. I'm gonna just tap that a little bit. Um, I don't know why, like, I think it's winter weather. Now, does this, is anybody else like me where like different weather makes you crave different things so bad? Like when it's winter and like cold and kind of like snuggly weather, I wanna eat red meat. I don't know if it's like a deep set like cellular level survival instinct or what like some people are like hot cocoa sounds great or you know like I'm gonna eat a nice stew and I'm just like where's that steak at yes burger time tonight onion ring french fries it's gonna be great I'm so excited my scrunchie has just given up okay do you see what I mean like this color in this sh foundation shade is just not quite right i feel like in the sh the monitor especially it just looks wrong like i look a little ill i think it's just too golden um but i don't know about this but i will say that upon second inspection i think this primer it's the shit man it's like smooth yeah now I'm going to just grab the same shade here that I had in my crease and I'm just going to go lightly under my eyes and then mascara and eye look is done. And since we're using this palette, I'm going to try this contour shade. And this is a little 
secret I learned from Jamie French. She's like, she blends her contour up into her hairline, like at her temple instead of straight back because she also has a little bit of a heavier face like I do. And she was like, it makes you look thinner from the side. And I'm like, if I can look thinner from the side, I am all about that. And now a little blush, got my frisky business. Use this kind of fun brush, we'll see what happens. pretty okay, and now for the part that makes this Mike's favorite look the red lipstick so I use lip sense on bold colors like this um, it's an MLM product I'm just gonna say that but it works fucking so good so I'm using it And that, my darlings, is my finished look. This is Mike's favorite look, so let's see what he thinks. Hey, Mike! Come here! How does my makeup look? Good. You like it? Uh-huh. You like my love color? Uh-huh. Is it your favorite? Yes, it is. All right, so it gets the star of approval. Um, all right, you guys, that is it for me tonight. We're off to go eat that cheeseburger. Um, thank you so much for joining me. If you like this video, please make sure to give it a like and a subscribe. It really helps out my channel, and I will love you forever. All right, my little love bugs, have a great rest of your night, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye, 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 bye.